feel like I'm a bit all over the shop this week. I don't know how many you've put up, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We'll have fun anyway. So this is my planner book for December. The paper is close to my heart from my bestie. So is the gold glitter paper. Um, it's in the magazine now here in Australia, so I assume it's all over the world. Um, so go and check it out. They have some really beautiful stuff. These little die cuts are from the reject shop here in Australia. And what I've done is I've str I strung them together. Can you see there? I strung them together so I have a bit of cotton hanging off. So I just thought I'd show you how I set up for the month. This is my planner there. So I do that. Then I have an index page. You can't see a thing. Come on, Grace. This is why I keep an eye, because you'd never see anything if I didn't. So I have an index page, and I just um, usually just number every second page like that. Well, I've done both here, so I've left some room. So that's page one there, so notes might go there or something. Then monthly, and I already have this in my current planner book, but... This just, Bonnie, this just um, is ready to go. And then I have always, I've got a yaw. Oh, sorry. Oh. Always have a notes page before I start my book. And this is, like I said, I've said in a few, it's an, called an exercise book here in Australia, but it's um, a soft-covered composition book I suppose and I get the grid somebody goes how do you write in that grid well I don't really I just write on top of it sometimes I do it depends how particular I'm being so that's all I do and in my current planner um yes I change back to my leather I know I'm a swapper and a changer I do have December in here ready to go but this is on the go because I don't put this one in till the last week this doesn't go in till probably the last week of November so this just keeps me on the go while I'm um, moving and shaking uh, what else did I want to show you um Something else I've thought of. Oh, while I'm here, I've been doing a journey. I started three days ago now on the Sheik Sparrow YouTube channel. They're doing a chat two week journaling challenge. So, what you do is you get a journal for the first week and you just write what is in your head. It's amazing the change. In my journaling, I think, just doing the the challenge for for a few days. It's just it's you know how you when your brain dump you just write everything down you don't organize it. Well, this is like a brain dump journal. It's you write what's in your head, just get it out. Doesn't matter. And that's how I used to journal, but it sort of fell by the wayside. Somebody needs a bit of work. So I've been doing starting that and then the second week you still do it but if you have something go on if you have an issue you write the issue down like you're talking to your best friend and then you be the best friend and you give that per yourself a solution which I think is cool too um usually when I journal I do that I don't necessarily write it like I'm writing to my best friend but um, I do end up sorting it out, so that's pretty cool. So that's what I've been doing. So my journal, see, it's like this for the first few days, and this is where I got started in the um, challenge. So here's today. 
So yeah, it's just somebody calls it word vomit. That's a bit gross, but um so I just thought I'd show you this. How I set it up. It's very, very basic at the moment. I did print out and I've kept them separate for now. These are from Miss Wonderful. Um, gift lists, so name and ideas on where, price, if you've got it and if it's been wrapped. So, go and have a look at her, um, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I've only had one coffee, I'm surviving. Go and have a look at her Christmas stuff and it's all free, you just print it out and say thank you, always say thank you. So that's a good, great idea, and you get six per page per side. So six people, that's a pretty good whack. Um, so if you do it double side, that's 12 people's gifts for Christmas. So, or you can have, if you're buying for me, Grace, 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 Grace. Joke. I'm joking. <laughs> Uh, somebody said, oh, you still celebrate birthdays? I went, yeah, it's not about the age, it's about the gifts. I know, naughty. Anyway, so that's what I do. Just get it ready, decorate it, and have it ready to go in. Um, oh, excuse me, I'm very yawny today. I don't think there was anything in here that I wanted to show you. Oh, i got to show you these. I went to scrapbooking the other day. You're going to die. They're so cute. Oscar John. And, um, let's see if I can do this. Look at these die cut. Oscar. Aren't they cute? The die cuts and stamps. Now, buddy, really? Really? You're going to be that rude. These people are trying to listen to your mother. So I did the whole set. They are so huge. Cut out the dies first. I don't have a die machine. That's a dream one day. And then you, um, is that all of them? Then you stamp them afterwards. They are so, so cute. No, it's not all of them. I always like to think of myself as the little bat clock. Which one are you? The frog and the bunny's kid. Oh, and him. The otter. Is he an otter? You people will know. But aren't they cute? So they're close to my heart as well. So if you have a die cut machine, get these. They are so cute. I don't know what I'm going to do. I thought about um, stacking them like this and then laminating them as a bookmark. See, you stack two rows. He's sitting on his head like that. What do you think? That's cute. Anyway, I'm just babbling now. They are really cute. So if you get close to my heart stuff, not spot hash, hashtag not sponsored, but they're cute. Anyway, that's all I have for you today. I hope you have an awesome weekend. I hope you get to do something fun. And while I have started this, you know if something else pops up and I get to buy something, I might end up taking the cover off this and putting it on the new one because I'm terrible. We'll see. All right. Oh, and if you haven't gone to A Graceful World on Facebook, please go. 
I got um, one of the ladies in one of my other Australian groups, Australian Aussie Christian planner, Planners. She does beautiful calligraphy and I asked her if she'd do you guys a freebie and she's done it and it's free over on A Graceful World. So go over and print it out so you can remember to be all you're created to be. Bye.